everyone. So today I wanted to talk about how effective partnerships can be for your business. So when I talk about partnerships, uh, I'm, I'm thinking about it in terms of, um, you know, you have an idea of what your ideal client is, where else, um, you know, uh, which are the products, which are the services does your client buy in your location? And thinking about partnering up with those, um, you know, businesses and uh, setting up a, a referral agreement where, where each client that is referred to your business um, you know, would mean that you would pay a referral fee uh, to that partner. And it can be really, really effective, particularly if you're starting up or you're set up in a new location, because you can you can partner up with these companies who already have a long list of your ideal target clients and effectively really focus your marketing efforts there. So the way to, to think about it is to try to start, first of all, with what, what I would call complementary services. So you're not partnering up with direct competitors. So for example, for us, you know, we're predominantly a residential cleaning business. Um, so we would start to think about, you know, targeting, um, you know, oven cleaning specialists or window cleaning specialists, dry cleaning companies, um, you know, uh, companies like that. Um, and the, the way we set up the referral fee is simply um, if that partner refers us a client, we would pay them an absolute dollar amount, you know, maybe say $50, $100. But it's important, it's enough um, that, that uh, you know, your partner partner is happy to refer you and gets a decent return for these referrals. So partnerships can be really, really effective. Uh, you know, what you want to be doing is gradually adding partners over time um, and, you know, focusing and building those relationships so that they become a steady stream of, of referrals in the future. So a really, really effective thing to do, one we use widely in our business and something I would advise as well.